It's estimated Panguitch Lake right now is holding about 20,000 acre-feet of water. That's less than one-tenth the amount that was in Teton Dam that failed in Idaho in 1976, killing 11 people. But documents obtained by Fox 13 shows a Panguitch Lake dam failure would pose risks to ranches, campgrounds, and highways. Floodwaters would reach the town of Panguitch less than two hours after a breach. Panguitch Lake Dam was first constructed in 1872 and has undergone upgrades and repairs over the last century and a half, including in 2011 when a dive team had to be sent into the lake to help repair a gate that had failed. After an inspection last year, the dam was judged to be in satisfactory condition. So concrete ages and, and things happen with that. John Rice is an associate professor of civil engineering at Utah State University. He has not studied the Panguitch Lake barrier, but said wet winters and springs do put extra strain on dams. The incident or the crack could have uh, formed a few years ago, and it's only now that the, with the water against it that it's showing up. Panguitch Lake and Panguitch Creek are popular fishing destinations. Rice says a huge flood would erode out the channel, eliminating wildlife habitat. Of course, you'd lose the reservoir, which has become habitat.